April Starkweather. Starbucks. Yeah, it's lame work shirt. Line number one. She doesn't work. I make you swear it. Uh, I should have gotten <coughs> changed. I never. I have another shirt in the car. No, no, that's cute. That's cute on you. <laughs> yeah, right. I know. I thought it would be nice. <laughs> so, you're a bad seed too, hmm? Huh? Nah, maybe a little. <clears throat> now you know what I do. What's your story? Hmm. Photographer. Videographer. Like for weddings? Long time ago. Not just record random things. Like? Life, people walking across the street, birds in the telephone wire, kids playing baseball. This. <laughs> Is that thing on? Do cameras make you scared? No, well, not scared, but <laughs> maybe it feels like an invasion of privacy? Try to think about it like this. You're an actor in a film without even having to act. <laughs> That's still an invasion of privacy. So kill me. Well, what are you gonna do with it? With everything you record? I take all the footage and try to cut something together. A film. <laughs> so you're gonna make me a movie star? Mm, let's have some fun. Rule number five, last words. Always get them on camera. A glimpse into their soul captured on video before they die. So they can be remembered by me and anyone who sees it. Tell me your name. Okay, come on, stop it. Tell me. <clears throat> Jessica Fueller. And you are? No, this isn't about me. You're not even gonna- It's about you. Seriously, you're not gonna tell me your name? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Raymond Lee Parker. Pleasure to meet you, Raymond Lee Parker. What's your favorite color, Jessica? Black. <laughs> are we done now? You're doing well. Why are you doing this? <laughs> I do this to remember the people I meet. What? Someone, you don't want to talk to me after tonight? Well, what do you have in mind? The same exact thing you do. Okay, okay. If I, if I get something right about you, then I get to ask you one question on camera. <laughs> so, you're a mind reader now. Well, well, hey, if you're scared, then... I'm not scared, okay. <sighs> okay, one guess. Okay, okay. You came here after working at Starbucks. Well, I'm right. Yes, you're right. Okay, you got it. Line number two. So I get to ask you a question. Well, it's not really fair because that was on my shirt. You agree to the rules. Okay. Have you ever kissed a guy on the first date? <laughs> you have to answer. Yes, of course. Okay. Have you ever invited a guy back to your place on the first date? No. Line number three. These are the questions? I thought they'd be a little more interesting than this. Alright, okay. Has a guy ever given you a better orgasm than your vibrator? <laughs> Did I go too far there? Okay, okay. Has a guy ever given you a better orgasm than a girl? <laughs> oh my god! Yes or no? <laughs> wait, just wait, okay. Come on, yes or no? <laughs> You said only one question. <laughs> We're both adults here. You're scared to answer. Uh, no. Never. No. Come on. <laughs> Vibrator and girl win every time. <laughs> whoa, whoa, wait a minute. <laughs> Vibrator and girl? <laughs> you heard me. <laughs> oh, man. Whoa, whoa. Okay, okay. I'm sorry for all the fellas out there. <laughs> Ow! What was that for? Because you are a bad seed. Alright, alright, alright. Let's make a bet. <laughs> okay, I'm listening. If I can make you have a better orgasm 
the best orgasm yet. <laughs> You're pretty confident, Then Mister. I get to kiss you. <sighs> if you won't be doing that already, then you're already losing. Is that an invitation? Damn straight. 